Black Box Productions. Y'all know I'm Bay, Mac, Bay Machiavelli, a.k.a. VJ Keyway, on oh, my mama mama. I be trying to ride for cuz, but this right here, cuz, this right here, I don't get on oh, my mama mama. My grandmother, she's not here right now. She's my angel. I know that, and she should be his angel. I've never heard him talk about her like that. But I know Kim Kardashian put out one tweet, and she is angel, which is crazy to me. But I appreciate it. Like I said, my brother is innocent, and I hope she can get him out. I want him to come home. Uh, I see where Monica is, ride or die. He just started talking back to her seven months ago. And I know maybe it's prison talk, or, you know, I know he's, he's incarcerated, and I get that. But still, you have to have a heart for the people that really helped you. Oh, my mama, mama, cuz. Cuz starting to sound like Lil Richard, cuz. Like, for one, you want everybody to respect you as the mogul that has done so much and accomplished so much to where you are not needy. The last thing you should want to come across and appear as needy of anything. But I've seen him make commentary about Tyler Perry and other um, powerhouses in the game of uh, melanated people and the way that they kind of like respond to him. And it seems as if he typically um, expects a different type of interaction based on his success. And he doesn't get the uh, praise that he um, deserves based on the success and on my mama mama just looking back analyzing everything and based on my personal experience with him i'm like damn i'm feeling because you know campaign i understand overstand as to why he might reach that conclusion and perhaps he do need or deserve more accolades more respect than he deserved you know could put it down he did it major and i've been riding with that on my mama mama i appreciate pete in my own life i told y'all that recently when I came across this clip, it was kind of hard to ignore because it's like, oh, my mama, mama, I don't get it. Like, you just, what you said at the end is all that matter. Cuz said it might be prison talk. I get it. If that's the case, then what is this whole statement about? Dude been down for, I don't know how long. And. I mean, a stretch, 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 stretch. Now, he got a female stepping up to the forefront of his situation. And with whatever he's going through in that dungeon, the darkness, whatever she's bringing to the situation, the hope for the future, the positive outcome, the possibility, the potential of being free has caused him his personal experience to feel as if an angel has attended his side and now somehow you feel slighted, you bringing up his mother. Now, angel people, people might feel like anyone can be, have their best intentions at mind. But a angelic presence is not denoted by intentions, but rather results. And just imagine you, his grandmother, who he loves dearly perhaps, have been a part of making efforts of making something wiggle all this time. And you can't be his angel if you are his brother or his mother. You are directly related to him. You are a part of his bloodline. And your motivation for being involved is right there established. This is your brother. That's her son. And we sure he appreciates y'all. He's going to appreciate y'all regardless. However... When a stranger who is not your brother, not your mother, not your kindred, not your kind, she's also a other, steps in out of nowhere and shows you assistance, that is an angelic feeling. That's an angelic presence. Now it's not your mother who you know who loves you. It's not your brother who you know who loves you. There is someone who... We have been brainwashed to see angels bright and white. Someone who is not dark skin pops out of nowhere and makes you feel like your future is going to be better. That is an angelic experience, Mr. P. It's like you hating on the fact, like you blowing a whistle, like 
What if Kim K or Monica started feeling the passion behind your speech and felt the sentiments that you feel and now they stand in judgment of your brother like, why not show more praise to your family over us? If a cat that's, that's looking, facing dying in prison has done decades in prison, comes out public and got the support of two high power women. One of them, he calls the angel, and the other one, he calls his ride or die. Bruh, sit back and let that be. I mean, have you been so industry nized or industri industrialized? I don't know a word would actually apply, but have you been so Hollywooded out that you don't realize what you just said? It might be prison talk. So if that's the case, what whistle are you blowing? Why are your feelings hurt? Kick back. Don't let that man do what he do. Oh, my mama, mama. You know what he up against and what it might take. Damn right, she like an angel. <laughs>